in round 24, Dallas, Texas, with Kyle from Anderson. Going to take a look at some A2 rifles and other cool stuff. So uh, I'm going to flip this around, and uh, we'll get started, I guess. Let's huh? do Let's it. Start. That's the big boy. Yes, sir. A2 rifle, 20-inch barrel, 1 and 9 twist, chambered in 5.56 NATO. It's got your traditional A2 buttstock with your compartment. Oh, all the cleaning goodies. Yes, sir. Nice. Oh. Very cool. Cleaning or, like you said, little goodies. Yeah. <laughs> Throw some gumdrops in there or whatnot. Just clean, classic, simple design, man. Yes, sir. That's pretty sweet. I think pretty the part sweet. I'm most excited about, your front sight base, because I'm just a big front sight base believer. Mm -hmm. um, your triangle handguard cap. So if you didn't want to throw the triangles on here, you're good to go. And that deadly bayonet lug, man. Oh, yeah. Don't forget about <laughs> the, the pig sticker, as they call it. Right. And then, obviously, what what I'm, I already said most excited about the front sight base, but most excited about is this upper with the integral carrying handle and the a2 uh rear sight yeah that's not a bolt on that is uh, an actual a2 style upper right there yes sir a2 style rear sight even very cool and uh i got this in the pistol flavor too right we do let's check it out yeah big shout out to our friends at gideon optics for helping us with the trip to interam gideon optics offers a variety of lpbo dot and prism optics my favorites are the rock dot siding green which i have on my kyger 9c pro and the advocate prism sight that is mounted on my very fun to shoot strybog 22. get in gives you great features like your choice of red or green emitters shake awake technology picatinny rail adapters included and all optics come with an outstanding lifetime one oh yeah Make sure she's safe. Heck yeah. I really like the pistol. I mean, if you're looking to make a truck gun, this already comes out the box. He's ready to roll for you. Right. Um, I mean, when it comes to mobility and pulling around corners, like, it really doesn't get much better than this. Again, chambered in 5.56. Five, nothing crazy, all mil spec. But just the aesthetics of the pistol, something you don't really see. I uh, usually do see that A2 buttstock, so right, very cool. Yeah, the A2, the A1, A2 buttstock, pretty iconic. So to have a brace on there is a little bit weird. Yeah. But uh, receiver, I mean, still your uh, integrated, whatever, the you know, regular A2, carry handle sight, front sight post, all the features. Just a uh, shorter barrel, no stock, right? I'd like to see the bayonet on this bad boy. That would be kind of cool, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Y'all like, got uh, y'all got a new Kyger too, right? Yes, sir. Let's, let's look at it. Long barrel, man. Long barrel. Yes, sir. So you're looking at your four and a half inch barrel, uh, your extended slot, but it's still running on the same uh, frame as the Kyger 9C. Oh, nice. So if you already got the frame, we are going to have the complete upper or complete slides available. Um, it's RMR cut. RMR, okay. Nice. It's got your low profile sights, and next up in line. But once we get this launched and taken care of, I'm hoping we get a pro edition. Yeah, the get pro those is steel really suppressor sweet. heights and the lightning cuts and the fluted barrel. So, right, that's what I'm hoping to see. Yeah, the but pro that's just me, really and cool. I'm not an engineer. So. Yeah, let's put it up. Put it up beside the uh, the shorter one there. Just look at the difference there. So, not a whole lot, but I mean, you can definitely tell the difference with that. Yeah, you're looking at only a half inch difference in the barrel, yeah. but. Yeah. Very cool. Yes, sir. Kyle, thank yep. you, man. Appreciate Thanks. it. Thank you, Clover. Uh, that's it for uh, this one from in round 